Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to the Home Renovators Absentee Auction for Wednesday the 29th of September 2021. Well, as in previous weeks, uh, the current health restrictions mean we can't have a physical auction, so we're having an absentee auction. Uh, you are unfortunately aren't able to come in and have a look uh, at the items. We've got them all listed online. You can have a look at all the photos and bid online. Now, the bidding closes at 10am on Wednesday the 29th of September. I want to show you a few things uh, which I think are absolutely fantastic. We had a big delivery of wood heaters this week and a big delivery of Electrolux French door fridges amongst other things so we'll have a, a nice in-depth look at those items. Uh, if you need to find out more about how to bid online there will be a video available to you at the end of this video that you can watch. Let's have a look. Have a look at these folks. I really want you to see this, this is a, um, a beautiful Scandia Avanti uh, wood heater. Now it can be indoor or outdoor uh, and it's got inside a stainless steel cooking plate so not only is it an indoor or outdoor uh, wood heater uh, or, or open fire but it's also got a cooking plate so it, it doubles as a wood fired barbecue so it's absolutely sensational we've got three of these come in this week uh, you'll be three months factory warranty of course uh, a really versatile little unit there um, so yeah you do your cooking Phoenix, you're cooking, out comes the plate and you can put some nice big logs on and then it, it becomes the open fire, indoor or outdoor. I reckon the bidding on those between 850 and 1000 which I think is going to be absolutely ripping buying. Right, now have a look at all these wood heaters that have come in. Uh, really nice looking ones. I'll focus on a couple. Uh, I really like this one at the end here, Lot 21, uh, the Stylish 10. So it's a nice uh, looking minimalist fire, uh, but it's got big performance, 33 square metres, uh, sorry, 330 square metres. Uh, and it also, because it's probably nearly a metre wide, it'll take really big logs. Uh, so I really like that one. That's a, a beauty. Uh, there's the smaller version of it there. That's the 220 uh, square metre version. Uh, the other one I wanted to draw your attention to is this Scandia Calora. Uh, so the Calora um, wood heater, it's a, called the 500C. You can Google it and find out more, but I really like that unit. That's a, that's a, a ripper. But look around you, there's absolutely heaps of them. Inbuilt, freestanding. Uh, there's some wood stacker models as well around the back. Uh, there's some ones with the built-in oven. Uh, so uh, just about every different style that you could, uh, could, could imagine. Uh, so there'll be definitely something to suit you. Spinning around here as well, uh, you know, there's the, uh, the 300 square metre with the wood stacker there, uh, the, the, um, the, the 300 uh, pedestal. Uh, so there's plenty of beautiful units here, really nice looking uh, wood heaters there. And I reckon, look, generally the bidding, if you, you can probably be, just depending on the size and the features, anything between sort of that, that $600 and $1,000 mark is usually uh, around the money where the successful bids usually land. So uh, really nice looking gear there, very, very nice. Uh, nice little beef eater um, inbuilt uh, stainless steel fridge there, the beverage fridge, that's pretty nice. I'm guessing about that sort of $900 mark would be about right for that. Uh, some flat pack uh, outdoor kitchen. There's a couple of those left. They've been really popular. I think we've been through about a dozen of these. Uh, they are flat packs, so they're easy to get delivered to your place. They do come with the barbecue, the beautiful stone top uh, um, bench tops and the, the outdoor rated cupboards, the sink, of course, and the tap. So really nice unit. Around that 3500 mark is about the, the, uh, the bidding mark there. Loads of fridges. I'll show you these ones. These are all some, some nice uh, Westinghouse uh, French door fridges, but I really want to show you some down here. Let's go and have a look at them. I'm too excited to, have a, to wait. To, uh, to talk to about these ones. There's about 20 of these. They are absolutely sensational. Uh, we've got dark stainless and standless stainless in the colours. Uh, Electrolux branded. Have a look at them. They've got the, uh, the, the, the ice and the water and the ice cubes and the crushed ice and just beautiful units there. Uh, so nice and big. You know, you can put your, your big platters in here. Um, and then down through here, we've got the middle drawer. This will double between freezer or fridge and you can see so you can set the temperature all the way down to freezer or you can have it uh, all the way up to champagne and wine which is about seven degrees and everything in between so uh, that's great that utility drawer there then of course the big freezer down the bottom uh, with another utility drawer in there so really nice looking units uh, looking around online about that three and a half thousand dollar mark online I'm thinking the bidding will be sort of 1950 to two thousand uh, dollars and as I said there are 20 of them uh, they're beautiful and straight they're A grade and they've got 12 months factory warranty so we'll shine through there uh, really nice looking units. Have a look at all of them. They're absolutely sensational. So, um, you can, of course, you can look online 
have a look at the item number and you'll see a, a, a picture, at least one picture of each. Uh, still got a couple of these KitchenAid fridges. They're a favourite of mine. Uh, they were $11,000 when they came in uh, into, the, into the market. Uh, now uh, you're looking at around a bid just shy of $4,000 to get those away. Last couple of weeks, 3,900 bids have been getting those off the ground. So really nice looking unit with a warranty as well. So uh, the, check out, your, check out your, the catalogue on those. Heaps more fridges over this side. A uh, little bit of cooking gear here. We've got some, some nice looking range hoods. Uh, with the range hoods, probably anything between sort of 60 and $150 will be about the right money there. Uh, got some cooktops there as well, some gas and electric cooktops. Uh, moving down through here, mountains more fridges, all different sizes, all different styles. Uh, you know, this is a really nice one. I love this one. Uh, it's an Electrolux fridge only, lot 127. Uh, nice big fridge there. It's a really deluxe model fridge with the Fresh Plus technology. Uh, as of added bonus, it's got the, 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 water, the water dispenser at the front. I reckon about the $1,200 mark. In the shops, you'll be close to $3,000 on that one. Really nice looking unit. Uh, loads of ovens in through here to clear. Sort of ranging in money, I guess, between around the high 100s through to about the probably the high 200s, early 300s, just depending on the models. Uh, up top, loads of Frankie taps there, I can see. The nice Frankie black tap there, lot 133. They'll all be about sort of half retail or less. Uh, lots of bathroom hardware there where I can see um, mixer taps and all those sorts of things. So they're pretty nice as well. Uh, more Frankie, I'll get that door, we'll have a look in there. More Frankie taps there. So I reckon there's a good, probably 20 or 25 different Frankie taps up for auction tomorrow. Really nice looking units. Uh, and as I said, you can just check, click view items and you'll be able to see everything that's available. Uh, down the bottom, we've got heaps of sinks in. I'll show you some more sinks in a minute. Uh, these ones are pretty nice. Then lo lots more bathroom furniture there. We've got um, uh, some shelves and all sorts of bits and pieces for the bathroom renovation. Down through here, loads more ovens. Um, these ones are pretty good. These ones will be boxed up, ready to go with a two-year warranty, the two different Asato ones, around that $250 mark on those. Well, lot 183 and 184, uh, they're pretty nice. Uh, also got... Um, um, plenty of cooktops up through here, gas cooktops and electric cook, cook, cooktops again. Uh, more range hoods as well. And again, similar sort of money. And I'm guessing sort of one to $200 on the range hoods. Uh, so you'll, you'll buy really well on those. Down the back here, I can see there's some Bellissimo uh, Technica uh, ovens there. A couple of hundred dollars on those. They'll be good buying. Um, that nice Euromade. Uh, is that one sold? I think that's sold. So I won't talk about the sold stuff. Sorry, guys. Uh, Analto fridges. Uh, there's a, a Euro fridge here. I've uh, got a couple of those in boxes. Uh, and the Analto fridge there, that's lot 206 with the fridge up the top uh, and the freezer down the bottom. About that $1,000 mark from memory is about right on those. Two years warranty as well. All right, let's have a look at these sinks. Now, there's a heap of sinks to clear tomorrow. Uh, lots of 377. Uh, what do we got? About 371 through to 377. So heaps of these sinks. Check the catalogue for the different sizes and and, ser and model numbers. You'll be able to Google these. I'm thinking sort of $50, uh, Around that money will get you a nice brand new sink. So uh, And loads of laundry troughs there as well. Uh, single and double laundry troughs. They're pretty nice. Quite a few vanities to clear as well tomorrow. Um, and again, you're probably between sort of $50 and $300, just depending on which one we're talking about. Uh, let's see the, uh, the ARC, what's this, a 900? Yeah, 900 oven. Uh, I'm reckoning probably about 500 bucks will get that away. Uh, there's a Bellissimo one there as well, probably about the same money, $450, $500. Uh, nice buying on the 900s. Lots of these inbuilt microwaves and compact ovens. Uh, and again, check the, uh, check the catalogue for the details on those. I reckon you'll probably be at least half whatever you can pay out in the, out in the field. You'll be able to get pick these up for. Uh, more ovens there, more range hoods. Heaps of range hoods this week. That's good buying. It's a nice Euromade flat box canop canopy range hood there. Three months factory warranty. I'm guessing probably about $100, $120, $130 maybe. Uh, more compact gear here. This is all nice stuff through here all the compact ovens uh, this steam oven there um, down the bottom we've got lo loads of these euro seven kilo dryers going out around that 300 dollar mark last week i think was where the bidding was landing what else can i show you heaps of these ovens and just loads of um of kitchen appliances again big delivery of kitchen appliances uh, so that's all pretty nice uh, down the bottom mirror furniture heaps of the mirror furniture uh, just put your offers in folks i reckon i'm reckoning look it's thousands and thousands of dollars worth in the shops 
I'm reckoning for the smaller stuff, about that $100 mark. Uh, for the larger stuff, a couple of hundred dollars, maybe $300, depending on how badly you want it. It's all pretty tidy having a look at it. Um, so, uh, yeah, really nice, really nice gear on that stuff. Uh, I'll take the time to talk to you about lot 281. We've still got a good 150 odd of these. It's the KitchenAid dishwasher. I'm sure if you've seen the videos before, you've, you've heard me talk about them. They do have the integrated front, so you do need to, to match that front up uh, to your current kitchen, uh, which, the, which a, ca a carpenter or cabinet, cabinet maker can do for you. But they are fully featured dishwashers. Uh, a mate of mine has actually bought a couple of those, and uh, I was using it on the weekend. Absolutely sensational they are. Around that mid-300s uh, off a, a retail of about 1400 so really nice buying. Uh, wine fridge there, I think we've got a couple of wine fridges, about that 900 to 1000 mark. Uh, what else can I show you through here? I've uh, got one or two of these freestanding uh, cookers left. Uh, it's the Euro, it's got uh, rotisserie inside, gas on top, electric inside. Uh, it's got the two year warranty, around that thousand dollar mark will get those away. So, oh, it looks like there's a few there, one, two, three, four, five, look about six there. Uh, so they're fantastic, those units. Uh, plenty of these Electrolux 900 ovens. Uh, if you're a baker or a roaster, uh, this is what, this is what uh, dreams are made of. These are absolutely sensational, about $4,000 in the shops, bake and steam function, got the food probe for the temp so you can, uh, it can cook to, and to the temperature, uh, I reckon probably about two and a half would be about the money on those, um, got a couple of these KitchenAid inbuilt coffee machines left, really nice looking units, about that $1,600 mark gets those away, boxed up beautifully of course, ready to go, 12 months factory warranty, uh, lot 291, uh, one or two of these left, Looks like two of those are left. Uh, really huge buying. Uh, last week the bidding was about the 850 mark on those with a two-year warranty. Uh, so really nice, uh, really nice buying there. Uh, through the back here, still got a couple of these beef eater outdoor range hoods. Uh, from memory, about. 15 odd hundred dollars, uh, maybe a bit less, could, could be sort of that $1,200 mark, but they're really nice buying, fantastic. If you're doing an outdoor kitchen, absolutely sensational. We've got some of these uh, wood storage racks as well, the, the Forge wood storage racks. Uh, from memory, had they been a few months ago and the bidding was around that $250 to $300 mark, so uh, they're pretty nice. About $500 in the shops, uh, so really nice buying on those. Uh, lots of dishwashers this week, heaps and heaps of dishwashers. This is a favourite of mine. Uh, Westinghouse make an absolutely fantastic dishwasher. Uh, so this is about a mid to high range um, in the model uh, and it's got uh, all sorts of different features. Really nice looking unit there. Uh, it's a good workhorse. There's plenty of those, so 337, uh, 338 amongst others. But check those ones out there. I really like those. They're a, a, a terrific model. There's more now. Uh, lot number, what have we got? Uh, 341, 342. I'm guessing bidding around that mid 500 mark on those. Uh, really nice units. Uh, there's some lower lower models as well out of Technica and Euromade. <clears throat> these are scratch and dents, so you can see there's a few dings on these ones. Perfect for the landlords. Um, let's have a look probably about that uh, high 100s, early 200s, I reckon. They'll have a factory warranty, uh, so, you, so you can you bid with confidence on those ones as well. Uh, a couple of washing machines as well, both front loader and top loader. Uh, there's a nice one. I haven't seen that one before, the Euro, uh, the Euro dishwasher, lot 349. Uh, I reckon that'll that'll be around that high 200s mark there. There's a twin tub there that brings back memories. The twin tub. More of these Westinghouse units. Look, they're really nice units, guys. They're absolutely fantastic. Uh, you won't be disappointed with the performance on those dishwashers. Around the corner, some Electrolux dryers there, six kilo, six kilo, six kilo. So really nice looking units there. Uh, they make a terrific dryer, Electrolux. So that's fantastic. Uh, Euromade freestanding cooker there. I'm guessing sort of between 800 and 1,000 on that one. Three months factory warranty, uh, five burners on top, and then an electric uh, oven inside. Uh, there's a nice little freezer there for someone. The um, the uh, Westinghouse freezer. Uh, I reckon that'll go around that sort of. 450 mark would be my guess. Loads more of these dishwashers. Again, these are those ones, they're probably grouse for a, uh, a landlord. Uh, I reckon you're sort of, yeah, 180 to 220 will be my guess on, on those ones through there. Little Simpson dryer there. Nice looking chest freezer here. What size chest freezer? 292 litre chest freezer. Nice size there. Um, I'm going to have a stab probably around that $600 mark, maybe a little bit less on there. So uh, there's heaps of beautiful stuff. Uh, big delivery from Electrolux Westinghouse this week. A uh, little bar freezer there, lot 399. I reckon you'll probably be around sort of 350 on that, 300 to 350 on the little bar freezer there. That's a nice looking unit. 
more range hoods here, fantastic looking um, uh, range hoods there. Uh, what That one's Westinghouse, I'm guessing about $150, $175 uh, would be about the right money on that. Some nice big top loaders here, Simpson 10 and 11 kilo top loaders there. Uh, they're pretty nice. Uh, so that's probably about all I've got to show. Uh, oh, actually, I'll, look, come on, guys, I know you've, you've got two more minutes for me. I want to show you these air conditioners. We've had these for ages, uh, so if you've watched the video before, you know, you know about them, but I want to remind you, I've personally bought a couple of these last week. They are absolutely sensational. So Scandia branded, there's 2.5 kilowatt and 3.3 kilowatt. Uh, so the 3.3 will do quite a large room, like a large bedroom or a smaller lounge room. Uh, they've got the their Wi-Fi enabled. They've got the um, all the stars, the you know, really high star energy rating. Uh, we've been through hundreds of these and everyone's absolutely wrapped with them. And you're about... 400, 415, 420 for the small one and about 450 for the large ones. Now, if you're looking for an air conditioner and you look online, you will see that that's miles off what's available. The prices are only going up on this stuff out in the field. So, uh, super buying. At the moment, there's probably 20 or 25 of each unit left and then that's it, folks. So, I really wanted to make sure you had another look at those because uh, they are sensational. Uh, 12 months factory warranty. As I said, Wi-Fi enabled uh, they, and they're really good performers. So, if you think air cons uh, have a look at those ones do some research on the features but uh, as I said I bought a couple last week absolutely sensational uh, the gas log fires they will be almost they're almost gone as well I uh, just want to remind you about those so they go in the wall of course uh, remote control natural gas but they do come with the LP gas conversion kit inside so you can use them up the country or down the beach if you're on LP gas um, they've got the factory warranty as well very nice looking units uh, bidding last week was around that $1,400 mark all right, folks, so uh, if you want to find out more about how to bid online, if you haven't done it before, there's a video straight uh, after this one that you can click on and find out how to do that bidding. Uh, if you are the successful bidder, we will let you know uh, Wednesday afternoon or Thursday. So uh, good luck with everything. If you've got any questions, flick it through on the email and we'll get back to you. Thanks for watching, folks. See you next week.